Hi folks, it's Max from uh, GalaxyNote2.com and uh, I'm over here in uh, Korea snowboarding. Anyway, I'm going to keep doing ROM reviews. I've got another quick ROM overview of the T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2. Um, this is the Mayui ROM. It's one of my favorite ROMs. One of the coolest features I like about this ROM is from the lock screen, you can hold down the center home button and get the flashlight. That's really cool. And you got the camera. Uh, phone there, messaging, unlock, and there's also more shortcuts. I'm not going to go over it. Uh, if you want to, if you're interested, you can go look more into it. Now, one of the things I really like about this one, it's made for the T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2. Please do not flash on any other Galaxy Note 2s. One of the features I really like is that you still get the Note 2 camera uh, working fine, and also even the Note S Note app. So it's really based off TouchWiz, but it is MyUI, so you can get a bunch of different themes. These are all free. Um, you can get all of these Dark Knight, all this stuff. Um, I think you have to sign up for an account. Anyway, I'm having trouble downloading. But uh, with this, you can get a whole new theme with a different lock screen, uh, different icons, all of this stuff. It's really cool, and it's all free. And also even you go to settings and sound, you can download a bunch of ringtones. Now some of these things are in Chinese, um, but you know, some of the stuff, a lot of the stuff is in English. And at the worst, you can just kind of click it and just download it. Try it out. Try it out. So these are all free. Um, that's really cool. And uh, Mayu is a very good developer. They're kind of like the Chinese Sinogen mod team. Um, they make, you know, their own uh, UI. They even make their own phones now, Xiaomi Android phones. Uh, for those of you who are really into Android, be high on Android. And uh, let me show you some other stuff like, this is the notification bar. Now you'll see that with MyUI, everything's been changed, including the toggles, notifications, and the settings. Everything's a little bit different. While it does keep a lot of the same stuff, so this is still compatible with uh, other TouchWiz based kernels and stuff. So you can actually install Bullet Kernel and overclock it to 1.9 gigahertz. This one's also running Note 2 Core OC, so it's one, running at 1.8 gigahertz. So it's going to be really fast and it runs really fast. And uh, you don't actually have to. Uh, install set CPU, but if you do install it, it'll be set at 1.8 gigahertz. You'll still get pretty good battery life. I wouldn't worry about it too much. And also, a lot of the MyUI apps it comes with, like the music app here, um, and uh, also the gallery is a little bit different. And let me see, also the browser. Oh, let me show you the keyboard. Uh, keyboard is actually Samsung keyboard. Now again, one of the things I really like about this ROM made for this phone is that they kept the TouchWiz, they kept the S notes, and even kept the multi note, which is ridiculously cool. Um, so you get the MyUI with the multi window. I haven't seen a ROM like this, um, so this is a first. And I really like it. It's running really well. No bugs I've seen so far. Pretty solid. I mean, it's a port. Uh, to the T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2. So check it out. Uh, I think you'll like it. If you've never tried my UI ROM, it's going to be an eye-opening experience. Um, they're a very good uh, developer, team of developers. And uh, you can see it's running Android 4.1.2. And uh, uh, that's about it. So check it out and let me know what you think. And uh, if you have a T-Mobile Galaxy Note 2 or any of the Galaxy Note 2s, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynote2.com. We update you once a week with Ron Week Tips X more. If you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here, subscribe button there. Um, and uh, I'll see you guys later. And stay high on Android. Uh.